Yo, what is up guys? It's Suki no Tragedy and today we're going to be playing some Pokemon Ethereal Gates. Now, um I wanted to, to play this game, but I didn't know how to record like I'm recording now. So I found out how to do it. I'm using OBS at the moment and uh yeah, everything seems to be working correctly. Uh, don't mind that uh, I was testing out the recordings my bad, but um, yeah Let's get right into this. Do you need to know the controls of the game? No, I do not because I'm pretty sure it's simple I am a boy and our name is obviously Suki no tragedy uh, There we go. No, it's not Sui Suki. There we go. So your name is Suki. Yes. Alrighty. Um. Okay. There you are, Professor. Hello, and welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Hawthorne. People like to call me the Pokemon Professor. Firstly, study the Pokemon of this region. Now, this right here. This here is a Pokemon that are there are over 200 kinds in this region. We live alongside these creatures sometimes as companions and sometimes as colleagues. But despite our closeness, there is still so much we don't know about Pokemon, obviously. This is why I continue to study Pokemon at my lab. To unearth more of the mystery surrounding them and the effects that they have or they may have on the world at large. Alright, so it was a TV special, I guess, and we were born. Uh, let's get ready. Oh, yeah, I forgot I'm using this. I'm using my Xbox controller. Uh, also, at the end of the video, I'm going to talk about uh, the new 3DS that I bought and my hack 3DS that I recently hacked. So stay tuned for that as well. Oh. My. God. We obviously have to go. What? What are you talking about? The Pokemon Professor. He's here in Apollo's town. We live in Apollo's town. Yeah, so? So? So we have to go see him. I'm such a fan of his work. Yeah, maybe you are, but... Where is she going? Do we... Do we follow her? Ugh, fine. But it's your fault we have to sit through another one of those lame science talks. Wait, how is it my fault? I'm a silent protagonist. I don't talk, my dude. Alright. And there's our arrival, August. Come on, Suki, I've been waiting for you. Let's get a move on. I really like the design of this game. It looks really nice, honestly. I think it's better I, I, I honestly think it's better than Uranium. The look of it. And the Pokemon too. They look. They look. They look. I think they look a lot better. I can't believe the Pokemon Professor is actually here. I can't believe Suki and I are actually. Let you, eh, I can't believe Suki and I let you, actually let you drag us down here. The science stuff is boring. Boring? You are unbelievable. Both of you. What did I do? I, I didn't do anything. I'm going over to talk to the Professor right now. Whether you follow me is not. Follow me or not is up to you. Damned if we do, damned if we don't. Guess we have no choice. Yeah, I guess so. Um, excuse me, Mr. Professor, sir? Oh my. You should sneak up on me like that. You nearly gave me a heart attack. Hey, Brill. I want to give him like a British accent. No, no, Abriel. I'm fine. Or, fine, I guess an Austral Australian accent. I'm just over exaggerating. How may I help you all? I can't do it, I'll show you I'm gonna try my best to do one though. Uh, well, we, we, we were here because you asked us on TV if anyone was interested in Pokemon research. She can't possibly think that. Well, sir, the three of us are all interested. Oh dear Lord. Really? Oh, really? That's wonderful news. You know what? Uh, I'm trying to do a different accent. 
form. So I do a Brazilian. I don't know. I don't know. You know, the three of you are only visitors I have gotten all day. The population here is very small. But I need all of your help I can get. I need all the help I can get. So thank you so much. Not a problem, sir. How can we help? Well, I'm not as young as I used to be. But because of this, I need help surveying the southern part of the southern part of Lineka. If I ever wanted to get back to my lab in Wimbrio Town. I was wondering if your tree could Of course we'll help you survey the land. I'm sorry, she didn't think about asking us first. Oh, that is wonderful news. Thank you all so much for helping me. I'd like to give you all the gifts. You see, I have these three rather rare Pokemon. Wait, wait, wait. Did you just say Pokemon? You're giving us each a Pokemon? Yep, as a token of my gratitude. I got these three rare Pokemon and they are three of you. I'll let you decide amongst yourselves as to who will choose first. I don't mind I don't mind which Pokemon I get. I'm in it for the research. I'll choose last. Don't mind if I Suki should pick first. Obviously. What? Why? Because I haven't heard any complaints from Suki today, that's why. True, I'm, I'm, I'm technically silent, so you know. Whatever. I guess I'll pick second then. Well, go on, Suki, and choose. And obviously, I'm gonna choose this one. Hey, Brill. I want a Hey, Brill. Alrighty. Now, choosing our starter. Let's see. We have the we have Furling, the grass flying type, which looks like uh, Snipe, a, little, a little bit like Snivy. We have Kit Torch, that kind of reminds me of Litten, even though this game came up before the Sun and Moon announcement. It just reminds me of Litten. And then we have Bubble, which is a really unique looking water type Pokemon, to be honest. Actually, it kind of reminds me of a kind of reminds me of a mixture of Totoral and Mudkip. Only on, because of the orange and the blue, the color scheme of it, I guess, I guess. But we're obviously going to choose Kid Torch. And we're not going to give it a name because Kid Torch sounds pretty freaking cool. Okay, this one's mine. I'll choose the one that's strong against yours, Suki. Okay, that leaves this last one for me. Fantastic. Fantastic. You've all made such great choices. And of course, oh, oh, and of course, I have here for each of you a Pokedex. Suki received the Pokedex. It's a giant self recording encyclopedia. And it really helps you collect data for me. Anyway, the best the best direction to head now is eh, is west on Route 1 towards Cordell Town. I'm sure on the way you'll meet lots of interesting Pokemon species. Good luck, you three. And of course, it's time for me to dip. Hey, Suki! Leaving town already? You can see you're getting a head start. A head start, huh? Why don't you both battle me, and we'll see who's really starting out ahead. Yeah, no thanks. Uh, yeah, thanks, but no thanks, August. I'm gonna go on ahead and do some bonding with my Pokemon before I use it in the battle against you. Don't wuss out, April. Get back here. Well, you're still here, Suki. Let's battle. Okie dokie. You're challenged by a rival, August. Okay. Kid Torch, let's go. Scratch. And we're faster than it. But I think that's I think it's a lot stronger. And then use grow. Well then might as well tail with it. Oh. Just trying to drop my attack. No, thank you. Tail whip it, tail, tail whip it real hard. What's happening? Oh, no, thank you. Scratch. Whoa, wha whoa, 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 whoa. Please don't kill me. Oh my gosh, clutch. Clutch, my dudes. That was clutch. And we're level six. And we learned Ember. 
Not too shabby. Of course. Wow, that was a fun battle. And this one's gonna be mine, though. Anyway, I'll see you down the road. Alrighty. So now that we beat our first rival, we can head to the next town, since that's what we need to do. And, oh look, it's my mom. I heard about your Pokemon journey. I assume you've been traveling very far. How exciting. To celebrate, I got you something special. Suki received the running shoes. They're called the running shoes, and they make you run incredibly fast. And the instructions say hold the Z button to run faster than ever before. I can't make heads or tails of what that means, but I'm sure you can figure it out. Anyway, good luck. And don't forget to come visit me every now and then. Bye, Mom. And we can run now. Alright, and here's our first wild Pokemon battle. And it's a Bamboos. That looks like it's a grass type, so let's try Ember. It is a grass type, and boom. That was, that was pretty easy. Uh, I guess I'll try to level, level up a bit more, I guess. An average. That's obviously a flying type. But it could be a flying normal. Based on his color scheme. Oh, it's faster than me. Okay. Level 7. Just started and we're already level 7. Mm -mm -mm -mm. What is it? Another bamboos. Or bambaus. Ah, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Bam I'm just gonna call it bamboos. Sounds. It rolls off the tongue a little bit better. Bamboos. Alright. Wow. A bunch of Pokemon back. A Verba. I guess that's the bug, bug Pokemon of this region. Alright. Ember. Okay. Virgil Fame. Alright. I see there's a Pokeball and an Ornberry up there that I'm definitely gonna go get right now. Well, I'm pretty sure by the time I catch another Pokemon, freaking Kid Tour is gonna be like level 10 or something. I mean, with easy, like. Look up easy leveling place like right here. I could there's one over there, but I'm not sure if I can get that. Alright, two orange berries. Yeah, I like to pick them. Orange berries, I would like to pick them. Yes, yes. Uh oh. Another Verva. I really like this battle music. <laughs> Level eight. All right, uh, let's talk to him and see what. You seem like a strapping young trainer. Allow me to introduce. Allow me to introduce. Ah, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Hov. I work at the Mart in Corolla Town, which is just up ahead. I'm here on Route 1 advertising the addition of Pokeballs to the Corilla Town Mart. Here's a free sample. And we got the Pokeballs. Oh, um, I forgot that we got our Kid Torch now, so I forgot to add that to, um, the little bottom there. Hello, mate. Don't forget to go to check out the, the Mart. Yeah, sure. All right. I am now in Corilla Town. Hello there. Welcome to Corella Town. I'm here to guide you. I'm here to be your guide to our wonderful flowery town. Let me show you around. This is our town's Pokemon Center. There's a lot to do here. You can heal your Pokemon for free, talk to travelers just like you, and even use our state-of-the-art PCs to connect to the box that the box system if you use that. It's a wonderful spot for trainers to Pokemon alike. Now if you come over here, you have a park, obviously. So lovely, this is a lovely park, isn't it? Yeah, I like the tree. 
It looks really nice. This, here we are. This is the mart, or the market, or mart for short. Blah, blah, blah. He's just telling me about. He's telling me about the shops and everything. This over here is a town square. Up there is our town oldest resident, the willow tree. Okay. Just as this tree planted by a sapling our town's founder now provides shade for people and Pokemon. Well, that's it for the tour. Hope you enjoyed yourself. Thanks for sticking around for the whole tour. Let me give you something that will probably come in handy in your, uh, for your journey. Town map. Nice. Take care now. Alright. Well, we're going to go to the march and talk about the Pokemon Center. Welcome. How may I serve you? Bye. Um. So there we won. We have that. We're going to get... No, not ten. We're going to get four potions. Alright, and the rest we're gonna get Pokeballs. Alright. Thank you, come again. Alright, and now we head to the Pokemon Center to heal our Kid Torch. Thank you for waiting. Thank you for healing my Pokemon. Alrighty. So now we're gonna head to the next town. Cause I don't. Well, yeah, we're just gonna go around town and search for stuff. Okay. Ah, uh, one of my friends uploaded a Skyrim video. Uh, let's go in here. Hello there. Yeah, I'm going to uh, Avacid Forest. I'm guessing Avacid Forest is going to be after Route, whatever the next one is. I'm pretty sure it's Route Two. Alrighty. Uh, oh, hello, you're a traveler. Oh, more work. Thanks, lady. 30 years ago, my full-time job was taking care of her. Now, my full-time job is take care of me. Savage. Granny of Savage. Uh, let's talk to these guys. It's really nice to breathe the fresh air. You know, so much technology, people don't really get out much more. That's pretty true in the real world as well. Sometimes I'd like to take a stroll and admire the flowers. It's such a beautiful day. Alrighty. Um, I'm not going to talk to everybody in town, but I'll talk to most people. We'll go to the route to see other key Pokemon there. Okay. Anything over here? A house. Let's go and see bushes let's go see who lives here whoa a family she won't stop playing that video game system if it begins to affect his grades in school I'm gonna have to confiscate it I'm way I'm way too addicted to my Wii U we got this latest Smash Bros game I love to play as Greninja but they nerfed it in the end oh my gosh wow okay that's a little nod to that actually it happened in Smash Bros. When I was younger, we'd go out to the Willow Tree and play a game of stickball. The these new form of entertainment is so antisocial. Not really. Because you play online. So you play online and get to know people. That's how I got most of my friends. Well, not most of my friends, but most of my online friends or PlayStation friends I got from playing online. But we are now in Route 2, and we are going to go ahead and save the game. Yes, we know, I know. Are you sure you want to save now and overwrite? 
Oh, did it not save? Alrighty, so I'm gonna end the video here. Also, I want to talk about my new 3DS. So I bought a new 3DS yesterday, and I bought it because I want to stream. I want to. I want to let's play Sun and Moon. So I want to hack it, downgrade, and all that good stuff. Um, I was able to hack this one. It got a custom theme on it. Uh, the Kyokai no Kanata Beyond the Boundary theme. Really nice theme, but. All I'm doing is to learn how to downgrade. There's not really a method to do it without having an already, you know, modded 3DS. And I'm trying to mod my 3DS for the first time. So, of course, I don't have an already modded 3DS. So, I'm going to have to wait and see until I can find a way to downgrade this 3DS. Because once I do that, once I figure out how to do it without it messing up, without anything, then I'll go ahead and attempt to, you know, mod this for the NTR custom firmware so I can stream and record Sun and Moon before it comes out hopefully I'll have it modded but thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video peace out